Hey! So it, it is deformed already because... Okay, good morning everyone. Today, uh, I will make the drum pump that we will use the 60mm pipe intake water pipe and 60mm pipe output water pipe as well. So I will drill drill the drill this one drill the, the drum with the 60mm hole. So as as you know that we already have the original one that is the 60mm so this is the output so I will drill the input 60 millimeter here so make sure that I have the pipe here and I can find the place that is the in the middle Okay, so I just drill in the middle here. All right. I got the old one and I will take the original hole just cut original hole to attach on on that okay So we get this one and I will apply this one with a special glue like this and we got the original hole that we can just screw the the 60 millimeter part into this one. Okay, so now I already applied the glue and already firm, already hot, and I have to use this one. Okay, so uh, we already done with the 60 millimeter hole that we just made. And this is the original millimeter, 60 millimeter. So this one will be intake water pipe, and another side is the output water pipe. pipe. So we have to install this CV, uh, CPV, uh, PVC pipe. Sorry, CVC pipe. This one and this one. So first, I have to wrap with the airproof. Okay, good. Another one. Okay. 
Okay, because this is the 60 millimeter and this is the testing version that I I just want to use the plastic and rubber to wrap it. I don't I don't want to use the glue. So right now I install right away without glue, but I will wrap it because this is the testing version only. So I don't use the glue. I just testing if it work or not. If it work, I will apply the glue immediately. Everyone can follow this video if it works. So please stay tuned to see together. Okay. This one. Hey, and I put the last pipe. So the pipe will be connected. Connected. Use all all material. I don't want to spend my money to testing with this layout. So I will wrap the plastic here and here and here. Okay. So I hope everyone understand. Okay, this is, uh, we don't use the food valve and we just close this one when we install the water after that we will we remove it when we open the high force water Okay, intake water with 60 millimeter. And all connecting pipe here, we don't use the glue, so we need to wrap with the plastic and and the rubber. So I wrap from here to there. Okay, actually we don't we don't wrap like this. We use the glue, but this is the testing version. So we have to wrap like this. Easy to remove when we stop. If not working. But I hope it works. I believe it 100% work. 60 and 60 or whatever, but we put longer. Okay, it's done here. Start, I put water. Okay, the same. We will use the. Alright, and we need air pressures. I will connect the pipe from here to, to there about 30 or 50 meter from here to there and I just wrap all connecting pipe connecting pipe here to make sure it the waterproof and the airproof here to make it chuck.
Okay, what I have to do now, I just wrap all plastic with a rubber. All section tight. So we need to close the intake and output pipe to make sure that we will install the water until full fill the drum. So I'm going to check everything that's inside. Any leaking? Okay, good. Wait. Okay, as actually we have the air pipe here, the air pipe here and here. But today I don't use the air pipe, I don't drill the drum. I use only here the air pipe from original hole. And another one is the air pipe from intake pipe. So I use this one. I use the angle to make the air pipe. So we reuse uh, our job to drill the drum. Okay, so let's see if it works. You can follow my video to do this. Okay, so I'm starting to fill the water right away. Okay, so I use the rod to take the water out. Okay, I keep repeating by refill the water like this. Okay, full. Okay. All right. So it's full. What I what I have to do right now? So just close the plastic. Okay. Close. Airproof. Okay. So now. Okay, so it's okay. I'm going to open the output pipe right away. I hope it works. It looks like it's done Okay, I hear the, the, the sound of water flow. One, two, three! <laughs> I drink the water. <sighs> okay, so uh, it sucks me in. Okay. It's strong suck here. <clears throat> oh. Very strong. Oh, it's very strong. Oh my god, you can see the water is sucking. Suck very strong. Oh my god, it is sucking from intake. And so I'm go this is already suck. So I'm going to check at the output how it works. So I'm going now, but I don't know which way. Ah. Oh. oh my god it is deformed already because as I noticed that because the intake water is very big so the water is very heavy so this drum is being deformed already so I'm going to check how is the output work Woo! 
Wow! It is very strong. This is the drum pump. It's not siphon. This is a higher level from the output. So it's strong suck. And now my drum is being deformed. And I don't know what to do. But however, I just keep it working 24 hours. If it's broken, it just keep here. Okay. So this is my testing version on me. So uh, when I work, when the next video maybe I change something at the drum to make it stronger. So okay, I'm go back to check at the intake water. So it works. It works correctly. Let's go more. Oh, my God. Oh, my drum. It is very new drum but it's become deformed already maybe I just put some iron along here and keep make it firm make it stronger to make it stay still as you know that this is very big very big pipe at the intake water pipe never no one do like me they put just small pipe but now it's big pipe so that's why it is very hard to suck up so we go together to check uh, the intake water pipe. How how strong is that? Oh. oh, it's very strong shock. That's why the drum is deformed already. Let me check again, everyone. This is. This is the experience for me that I make the drum deform, broken, so everyone can just learn from it to make sure that don't put too, don't put too big high at the intake. As you can see, it's very strong. You can hear that. Very, very strong. Okay, I can put some leaf. To make to make that uh, to make sure that it is really sharp. Oh, it's gone already. <laughs> okay, I put a big one. Gone. It's gone. Woo! Oh my God! It's really really strong shot. Okay. All right. So it's work. 60 millimeter, 60 millimeter, but the intake water is shorter, but the output is longer and make it fresh. Very, very strong. And my my drum now become broken. It's become broken already. But I I think it it never go anymore. It's like uh, just keep just keep uh, deformed like this but it don't broken so I just keep it 24 hours to test my drum if, if it can stand here longer or not and I will be I will remove when when this one is uh, stop working and I just use my glue I don't use this rubber again because I'm sure that this is already work but it's hard for the drum because the water is too big the amount of water is too big and very heavy so make it deform so this is my testing version only everyone thank you very much for watching my video my tutorial today and I hope you enjoy with my tutorial subscribe if you are the first time watching my my channel and share for your friend if you want this video uh, to this video spread to other and other people who want to know about free energy water pump like this so thank you very much bye see you again with the next video
you can hear the water dropping this is the the the, the drum is pressed and it sucked the water from the 60 millimeter pipe from intake okay it's work okay that's it for my project my testing wasn't is successful okay Some uh, 